become the first country to demonstrate the ability of the conventional takeoff and landing F-35A joint strike fighter to operate from a highway as part of an exercise in Finland. The U.S. Marine Corps has already shown its ability to use its short and vertical takeoff and landing capable F-35Bs in this way, as the war zone has previously reported. Suitable roadways offer Air Force's valuable alternative operating locations in the event their main bases are struck or otherwise rendered unusable in a way to readily disperse aircraft to help reduce their vulnerability. The tactic is also valuable when it comes to complicating the enemy's targeting cycles and war planning. Norwegian F-35 as have been training to conduct highway operations in Finland this week as part of the latest iteration of that country's annual Bonner Road Base exercise, which kicked off on Monday. The jets were also, hot pit, refueled as part of the training, which means their engines remained running while they had fuel uploaded. This reduces the time required to get them back up in the air afterward and can further reduce vulnerability as well as increase sortie rates during surges in operations. Sometimes crew changes can also occur. Just shutting down complex fighter aircraft can increase the chances that they will have serviceability issues starting up again. For Bana 23, a section of Finland's regional road 551 between the towns of Kartula and Tervo in the southern end of the country has been turned into an impromptu airbase. From the pictures and videos that have been released, no special measures appear to have been taken to enable Norway's F-35 as to take off and land from Regional Road 551. Norwegian Joint Strike Fighters are somewhat unique in that they are the only ones in service today that have drag chutes. This feature, which is also set to be incorporated into future Finnish and Canadian F-35 as, is there to help the jets land safely in poor winter weather conditions. It also allows for less wear and tear on braking systems. This could be a relevant capability for road and other short field operations, as well, but there is no indication this feature has been employed during Bana 23. The F-35's chute is packed into a stealthy fairing between its twin tails. <laughs>